Hey guys, Joey from Crash J Video Productions here. Got another pen review for you here. Went to Office Depot to get this one. Uh, Office Max and Office Depot are now the same company. So anyway, here it is. I got a Cross Bailey. Look at that. And it doesn't specifically say what the uh, what the nib size is, but I'm thinking this might be a medium. We'll find out here in a minute. But it's got a beautiful blue finish, uh, all metal. It looks like. Um, I don't know if it comes with a converter or not, but I did buy a six pack of the short um, blue cartridges. So if not, we'll just use those. Um, this is the fanciest and most expensive fountain pen that I bought to date. So we'll just go ahead and unbox. And let's see. It appears we have some... I hate this kind of packaging. I'll just rip it open. I'm sure it's not defective or anything. Alright, here it is. Oh wow. That is a beautiful fountain pen. If I can get the thing out, there's the cap, and there's the pen. Okay. Yeah. Wow. It just sparkles. Well, it doesn't appear to have come with a converter, so I guess our only option will be to fire up with one of the uh, short cartridges. Guess it goes in this way. Yep, simple as that. Now, I did hear that these do go through ink pretty quickly but uh, that's something that we'll have to find out and I don't know if Do these fit These don't appear to fit. Hold on a minute. Huh. Well, that's on. Wow. Well, that is really weird. Unless, oh, that's why. There's another cartridge in there. The. Okay. There we go. Brain fart. Okay. Let's find an empty page. And we'll start writing. This is a cross 
Bailey. Oh, wow. And I guess this is, uh, I guess I'll just call that a medium. That is really, really nice. And it looks like the tip is kind of slightly bent a little bit, but seems to do the trick. Yeah, I don't know if that's the way it's supposed to be or what, but anyway, yeah, this is a medium. You can, I don't know if you can see the M right there. So this is, this is a medium nib. Yep. Yep. Wow, that is nice. Man, that is pretty. It's kind of a small pen, really, when it's uh, posted. But you can see the, I don't know if you can see, but the, the cross logo is spelled out on the, uh, on the nib. So that's pretty cool. Yeah. The uh the blue ink in this cartridge I will say is uh very similar to uh very similar to Whammy Blue. It's um, kind of a light blue. We'll have to see if um, some other cartridges are available over time. I'd also like to uh, see if maybe it's possible to add a converter in here at some point too so I can use all this bottle ink that's over here too. But for now, I guess I'll have to use these cartridges that I paid a fairly pretty penny for. So. Blade through isn't too bad either. Yeah. 